Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. It's your boy, Danny, coming back at it today. Just wanted to kind of get a new kind of image of me here, you know. And basically, I'm going to be recording today at the gym. You know, the program I'm going to be doing over at Athlean X. I did want to show you guys some of the activities I've been doing this week. These last three weeks are, you know, the last stage of this actual program he designed. So I got to actually work very hard and make sure that I push myself so that way I can actually move on to this next program I want to do called Monster Maker. It's going to be fucking dope. I was actually listening to Eminem's album. He dropped one out of nowhere, guys. What the heck? But it is flame. So I want to also show you guys here really quick. Follow me. Hold on here, guys. Just wanted to show you guys the workout I'm going to be doing. I'm only going to show you guys some of it here. So, take a look. So, now, basically, I have to do... You can't see it here. Hold on, I'm trying to focus. But basically, it says five rounds right there. So, I got to do these pilo push-ups. Then, immediately right after, dumbbell bench press. Then, I rest. Then I do pilo chin-ups, barbell rows, rest. Then I do dumbbell dead rows, deadlift, and then I rest. And I got to repeat that five times. And then I move into my size circuit right here, which are four rounds of these exercises. I do overhead press, then right into alternating reverse barbell lunges, and then right into side lateral raises. And then I do that four times, all of those sets. And then I freaking do one actual round of a standing uh, beast arm circuit. It's pretty intense. Basically what that is, is you don't put these dumbbells down. And you have to do 30 reps of, you know, standing curls. And then 30 reps of dumbbell tricep extensions. And you cannot let go of the weight. So you could do 10, and then immediately get on the floor, do the extensions, then 10 again. However you want to do it, you just can't drop it. So I try to show you guys, like, my last set of everything, just because, you know, this is going to take a while. Usually these workouts take, like, two hours. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> All right, everybody. So this is my first exercise I'm showing you guys here. It's an AB combo. I had to do eight explosive pilo push-ups and then I had to go right into dumbbell chest press with the weight that's gonna make me fail in five to six reps so I use 65 pounds and that's what you're gonna see here next just going for five to six repetitions here best form as possible it was tough this was my last set I had to do these in a set of five you know, right after each other. I would rest about 60 seconds, and this was the last one. All right, right here, guys, this is actually the next activity, the 2A and 2B. I had to do pilo chin-ups. You can see me, you know, explosively letting go at the top there, and then I had to go right into barbell rows with the weight that I can do, you know, uh, five to six reps with, you know, explosively here. And it was very tough. This was, you know, my last set of five for these AB combos here. All right, and I didn't record my C ones because it didn't do a good view. This was actually my other circuit I had to do here. It had, you know, I had to do overhead press, 12 reps with the weight I'd fail in. I have about 17.5 on each side. And then immediately right after I had to go into barbell reverse lunges until failure. Um, and that's about 11 to 12 reps for each leg for me. Um, and then you'll see after this, I go right into actually dumbbell flies at your side and it is definitely very tough just because doing them all right after each other keeping your shoulders like this too after you just did overhead press it was killing my shoulders i could feel like the burn and it was good it was tough i had to ignore it almost lost my balance there but i redid it 
Um, you know, this is definitely challenging. You can work up to it. I love it. It definitely makes me sweat so much. And yeah, so you can tell I was gassing out. This was the fourth actual cycle I had to do of these three exercises. And it was definitely tough. I was sweating so much. And yeah, you can tell in my face I'm giving out here. I'm getting close to failure. I have to dig deep. It was tough, guys. I definitely recommend trying to do workouts that, you know, have, you know, a good, you know, rest, of course, but keep it short so that way you're always working, keeping your heart rate up, getting those gains and sweat going. So, yeah. And then right after, you just set it down. It's dying a little bit, kind of shake out the lactic acid build up there. And then I just go right into these flies here. It was definitely tough, guys. And then I had, you know, another exercise I did. I just did not record it because this was definitely a long workout. These workouts take about two hours almost or more sometimes to do them properly. So it's very intense. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my Friday workout. I'm going to try to stay more consistent, you know, uploading videos, making, you know, better quality. It is a process, you know, some of these workouts take a long time, so I don't want to record everything, and nobody wants to watch all of that. You know, I do want to inspire people, give some tips here and there. I am currently studying. I have less than a month left till my actual personal trainer certification exam with ACE. I'm very excited, guys. Got to keep crushing it and killing it. Hope you guys enjoy your Friday and have a good weekend.